the night of Lyra's murder. And I want to appeal to anyone who recognises or knows these people to talk to us. About one minute before Lyra was murdered, three men walked across Central Drive from the direction of the shops. Here you can see these men. At the front you can see a man circled. He's carrying a crate of petrol bombs. Behind him you can see two other men. The man on the inside nearest the wall is the next tallest. You'll see this on the footage shortly. The man on the inside is wearing dark skinny jeans, blue night trainers with a white tick and a white sole. He's wearing a camouflage scarf or other covering across his face. I believe that the public know who he is. In other footage, you can see he can be seen holding a petrol bomb and in the new light, his clothing is now clearly visible. As he walked along the footpath, he was accompanied by the third man. You'll see from the footage that he is shorter than both of the other men and is of stocky build. It is my belief that he is the gunman that fired indiscriminately into the crowd and placed the community and police officers at risk. I believe he is the person that took the life of Lyra McKee. You can see he's wearing dark clothing and in the new light on this footage you can see his clothing more clearly. 